four, the first four through to the final. That world record standing to Marita Koch, not Barbara Vockel, who's been so supreme at this event. The world record stands to Marita Koch, who runs in the final of the 400 metres later this afternoon. So it's Baptiste, Evienne, Olkov, Nikova, Smallwood, Gachet, Vockel, Nuneva and Schmidt. And they get away. Now Cathy Smallwood beginning to make a run, but she's got Gachet outside her. Nuneva, Vockel going very well. Vockel coming off the ground of the bend in lane six, the better. Cathy Smallwood beginning to unwind. Joan Baptiste trying to run at the girl on her, but Cathy Smallwood's having a very, very easy, relaxed run to the line. And she will be second to Vockel, the French girl, Gachet in third. Nuneva in fourth. Joan Baptiste run out of it. Uh, but that was very tough opposition indeed. 22-8-0, when you think the Joan Baptiste time is 23-1 at her very best, uh, that, was, uh, that was some heat for her to come through. Mind you, she'll be enriched by the experience, that's for certain. There are some great girl sprinters here. Barbel Vockel runs in lane six, wearing the blue of the German Democratic Republic. She's chasing after the girl in red, Nuneva of Bulgaria. And they're both going past Heike Schmidt on the outside, who's beginning to fall back. Meanwhile, in lane four, wearing 307, the Reading girl, Cathy Smallwood, moving very beautifully, moving away from the Russian girl on her inside, getting up to Liliane Gachet, shoulder here. And suddenly these two emerge in the front of the pack. Vokal, the 27-year-old Olympic champion, in the lead. Smallwood, very easy, nicely relaxed, into second. And then it's Liliane Gachet in lane five between the two of them. She comes into third. Nunavia of Bulgaria, the 20-year-old in the red vest, is finishing fourth. Then fifth was Evian of Norway, and Joan Baptiste was six. The winner's time, 22.80. Cathy Smallwood, I must say, looked absolutely superb. Although she was in the wake of Vockel, she too looked just as relaxed. That same high arm action that we were talking about earlier with Cameron Sharp going, in Cathy's case, slightly across her body. But isn't that uh, elegant sprinting? Great bouncing rhythm. Knee pickup, carrying her along. You can see the relaxation in the cheeks. She's letting the air pass in and out the mouth without really taking deep breaths. Total lack of tension there. No strain in the shoulders or the neck. And look at that. Wrists like a swan's neck as she goes over the line. Good sprinting from Cathy Smallwood. 